at first thing first your uh, mesh is not um, unwrapped that's the main reason I can see in the UV texture editor it is not unwrapped so you need to unwrap it the way you unwrap it you go to one of the side view for example uh, and you uh, basically let me, uh, let me um, I don't have a mouse button for that so let me center it right here so when you have that you go right here and you start right clicking and you say faces and you select all the faces in that side uh, so you go like that so you select them all you make sure you have them all might not get them all completely uh, as soon as you have them all, I might miss one right here and that one right here, let's see one right there for example oops, you have a lot of little mesh I should have been cleaned out so as soon as you have that, you look at the axis of um, UV mapping basically a projection and you are in the X axis so you go to UVs you go to planner option and you say the X in the project from and you apply that all right um, let me see just a second in the uh, what's do a second Where did they put it? Right here, modeling editor. UV editor right here. So you have that mesh right here that is basically your um, your knife. You see that's where you know that's where your knife is. And you can see it works fine. Uh, I got it to work so you do that on all the sides basically and that's pretty much the way it works and then you rescale them properly right there in the zero one and then you adjust uh, you just apply your texture to it as soon as you have unwrapped everything in that you just go into the um, UV snapshot right here make a snapshot give it the proper size uh, change the format for a uh, uh, PNG and then you're good to go, you export it and open it in Photoshop uh, paint under the UVs, get rid of the UV map save it again and apply it right here that's the way to do it so let me know but I don't see I mean I'm looking at your stuff and let me see one thing so I go to vertex faces I can look at that yeah you have a lot of mesh that is not legit I can see it right here um, this is going to be very hard to get rid of I am not kidding you. If I select that and I go right here and I zoom in, oops, sorry, on it like that, what I'm going to see is that if I go to vertex face, as you see, you have those extra edges right here. What it means, it means that uh, you did not extrude it properly. You messed up when you extrude it. All right, so those are just really hard to get rid of. The only way you can really get rid of it is to go back to a uh, vertex, select two of the vertices, let's say those two right here. All right, and go to uh, merge, uh, sorry, edit mesh, merge to center. And if you do that on all of them, uh, usually you might be able to get it back and you're not very far from it. You have to, you see, I clean up one side and then if I clean up the other side right here see I can do that right here merge them same thing right here I merge them and then when I right click um, it's much better but you still have errors um, because you've deleted um, your edges by clicking on delete on the keyboard which I explained in the lecture to not do when you want to delete an edge you select the edge right here for example and you go into edit mesh delete edge vertices if you don't do that it will leave the vertices right, right here 
and that's your main problem right now.